In addition to specifying the start and end of the angle gradient, I can also adjust the shape of the profile curve that describes how the two are weighted. So the default under here under profile power is 0.5, which describes a linear blend between the floor and ceiling of the minimum and maximum values. If I s decrease, uh, the closer I get towards zero, the more the shape of the curve will resemble an exponential type of curve. In my case, it's going to favor the maximum value more heavily. Whereas the closer I get towards uh, one in the power field, the more closely the curve will resemble an inverse square type of uh, gamma curve, which will favor the minimum value more heavily. In my, in my case, I, I might want something a little more, so somewhere around there, like 0.6, say. Okay, cool. So, one, one, once I've gone ahead and I've adjusted the directional tapering, I can then start to go down the list and look at the distance-based or depth-based tapering.